Flights over oceanic areas managed by Australian Air Traffic Control will be more closely monitored following the introduction of an aircraft tracking trial. Air Services has worked closely with Qantas, Virgin Australia and global satellite provider Inmasat to successfully develop a trial using existing technology used by more than 90% of long-haul, wide-bodied aircraft operating to and from Australia. Using technology called Automatic Dependent Surveillance Contract, or ADSC for short, aircraft will be tracked at intervals of at least 15 minutes. While aircraft are flying high over oceanic airspace, outside of conventional radar coverage, the aircraft tracking trial will use Inmarsat satellites to communicate with air traffic controllers. A data package containing the aircraft's exact position, airspeed, altitude and heading is transmitted every 15 minutes to an orbiting satellite. The satellite's receiver antenna picks up the signal and then rebroadcasts the data down to the nearest ground receiver station. Once the signal is captured by the ground station, it is then sent by land-based fibre optic cabling to Air Services Air Traffic Services Centres or to other air traffic control centres in our region. On arrival at the air traffic control facility, the data is used to update the aircraft's information on the radar screen for the controller. An increased aircraft reporting rate will ensure that air traffic control have better information about the position of flights in oceanic areas and earlier advice of any abnormal flight behaviour. The tracking rate can be increased should an abnormal situation arise. This is a major first step as international agencies consider approaches to comprehensively track flights.